I have never seen anything like it. He was found guilty of manslaughter with a firearm. And when the verdict was read, one of his daughters started screaming and cussing. And the judge had warned everyone if there was an outburst, then she would have them arrested. And she was screaming at the top of her lungs, go ahead, arrest me. And we've got some video for you. We, the jury, find the defendant guilty of the lesser included offense of manslaughter. We, the jury, find the, we, we, the, jury find the defendant carried the slave, used or threatened to use or attempted to use a firearm during the commission of the manslaughter. Now, Bob Ward was accused of shooting his wife to death in their Islesworth mansion in 2009. The state said it was a murder, plain and simple, that Ward's business was failing, tensions were high, and that days before the shooting, Diane Ward was set to testify in their bankruptcy hearing, something Bob Ward did not want her to do. The defense paid in Diane Ward as unstable, mixing wine with antidepressants, and that Bob Ward was actually trying to keep his wife from killing herself. Now, this is the second time Bob Ward has been on trial. In 2011, a jury convicted him of second-degree murder, and he was sentenced to prison, but that conviction was overturned on a legal technicality. But today, found guilty of manslaughter with a firearm, he could get up to 30 years in prison. Live in Orange County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News.